What's up guys another week another beta video so IBS 14.2 beta 2 is expected to arrive this week yes this week IBS 14.2 beta 2 will arrive and I'm really excited for it though it won't bring some new features as per my prediction which are which is 90% correct and uh, I don't think there will be uh, some new features but there will be a lot of bug fixes especially Actually, the thing is that battery performance on earlier devices like iPhone 6s, iPhone 7 is really, really bad. I even tweeted out this, as you can see on the screen, and that that tweet got like 3,000 views in in less than a day. And uh, right now, that video is just not even 12 hours ago it was uploaded. And uh, by the time you are watching this video, that maybe that video is more than 10,000 views. And that and many people replied to me that yeah their iphone 6s iphone 7 is having really bad battery life and they they all have a great battery health like even my device my iphone 7 have 100 percent of battery health but then also i'm not getting enough juice from my battery next thing is the build number so the build number is expected that this is this will be a second last beta after the public release as second last or most probably the last as you all know that october 13 is the day i, I new iphones will be released and on that day we will see the iOS 14.1 110 percent i'm sure about this so please if you do find this video helpful be sure to hit like and comment down below what's what did you learn from this video now the next thing is storage so storage we will see a bit storage the ios will take a bit of your storage in the next beta which is the beta 3 so be sure to if you are an on older devices i especially iphone 7 and 7 plus users be sure to clean some of your storage because it will take some of your storage so i don't want you to uh, just delete all of your apps just delete few of the few apps if you you have particular amount of the update size will be around three two to three gigabytes like for iphone 10 r especially iphone 10 and users i am also using an iphone 10 r and all betas i've get on ios 14.2 is more than two gigabytes so i think it will be around two to three gigabytes for iphone 10 i users and for earlier users iphone 10 iphone 7 iphone 6 s users it will be around 500 to 800 mb now that's it for today's video. If you do find this video helpful, be sure to hit like and subscribe to this channel for latest tech info because I will be the first person to talk about iPhone 12, iOS, betas, everything. So thank you all for watching this video. Peace out. I'll meet you all in the very next episode.